Guys, I want to show you something. Fastoner kebab in Kiev. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm hungry. Let's check this out. Toner kebab in the Soviet city or actually Soviet country at that time, Ukraine in Let's see how it is. I can't read all of that. But I think that these things are, I'll think, all with pork, so I don't think I can eat them. But the donor kebab looks fine. Let's see. Hello. Hello. I'll get one donor. Um, something, what is this, like with the bread and put chicken inside? One minute, please. Okay. I think I will make it. We will make it in English. I don't know Russian. I just say only Pasiba. Vivian. And that's the end of my Russian. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. So, I will cut something like this. Okay. In the same bread, like big this here. Little. A big one, but with a chicken. With, with a chicken. chicken, right? Yeah. Yeah, so with chicken, please. Okay. Uh, 18, please. 80. 80, okay. okay 80. So, 80 is something 2, two euros 50. 250, I think. Yeah. A kebab in Kiev, in the making. It does not look like the one in, in Turkey, but still there is something like a kebab, a Soviet kebab, <laughs> Soviet kebab. I don't know if something like this even exists, Soviet kebab. <laughs> Let's see. <clears throat> is it locked down here? Is it locked down here? Locked down? Yeah. yeah. So the metro is open or no? The metro? Metro is not open. Not work. Not work metro. And the bus? The bus is? I don't speak English very well. <laughs> <laughs> no, the bus? Like the... I don't know. The bus? No, no, no. no. Also Lockdown. not working. So how do you go from here to some, some other place? Walking? Yeah. <laughs> okay. They say we have to walk. I don't know if they are walking. Are you walking everywhere in Ukraine? <laughs> Let's see. Passive. Enjoy. Thank you. The first Russian word I spoke here, Passive. <laughs> Let's go and see something here. Hello. Yeah. Oh, I cannot. Oh. So. so, I think we can have our lunch on those Soviet banks here, on the benches. See, they're so beautiful. You see that? <clears throat> so, I can sit here and enjoy the lunch. Enjoy the Soviet kebab. The Soviet kebab. Hmm. It's good. <laughs> so, I think, guys, I think I came here at the wrong time because there's a lockdown here and, and I cannot enter the metro station and they say that, that there is a special pass which can be issued by the mayor by the mayor of the city of, of Kiev and if I have this then I can enter the metro station. That is not good. And on every metro station, there is police 
and checking this card. Not good. Not good. But let's see if you can make it out something without the card. Let's see. Rest for the ticket here. Let's see if I can go inside here. Ah, I could enter here now. Yes. So I finally made it. The policeman at the at the entrance. I spoke with them a couple of times, and then because they did not understand me, and I don't understand them, so yeah, so they just let me in. Now you see here. That's huge. I'm on the metro number two, I think. It's the blue line. I don't know where I'm going. I just go and see the metro and then find out. And I don't think I should I should leave now the metro because to enter in the metro station it is quite difficult nowadays. And the metro station here in in Kiev they are one of the oldest in the world. So a couple of them are one of the oldest in the world and I will try to get one of those. Let's see. But look at that. Look at the Sovietness here. Because I want to take now the Metro 1, the red line. Let's see. But guys, check this out. The Soviet marble quite old wow check this out here check it out I don't know whatever that is I can say that but this is amazing look at the station here Ah, okay, this is Medan and here? Uh, yeah. Okay. Ah, okay, so straight and right. Okay, thank you. Paseva. So, I think we found something. We are, we are doing it. Guys, this is amazing. Even though I don't have this card, but the policeman at the entrance of the train station, he was nice enough because, well, we both of us would not understand us each other so he just said okay just let him in and it's fine <laughs> that's amazing so now here at this station the Maidan which one I want to take it I want you to take now is the red line and the red line goes to one of the deepest or actually the deepest metro station in the world Arsenal Naya Let's go there. Arsenal Naya. We are going to the deepest station in the world. I think the red line is here. Let's go and see. Before they kick me out from the station because I don't have this car. Let's see. Check the old Soviet train. Let's go. Let's go and check it out the Arsenal now. The deepest train station in the world. I have seen somewhere that it is around 105 or 150 meters below. Look at that. Okay, you will see now. I'm still on the accelerator. It's more than one minute now. And I'm still standing on the accelerator. Look at this. So deep. You see that? About 
about to end but now i'm not sure if i should go out of the station now because if i go out they will not let me in so i guess i should stay inside here but i will just show you around at the station here let's see and then go back and then go back all the way down to the end of the train line one and find out some more things look at this wow look at this big door and the old tiles like they have from the soviet time <laughs> Look at that. And we st and we are still not up on the level. There is one more escalator here. Let's see. That's the deepest train station in the world. Wow. Look at that. Check this out. Check this the beauty of this Soviet metro station. Check this out. Wow. Wow, look at this here. Look at those tiles and yes, so they are dirty, but still look at them, amazing. Check this out. I don't know what this is. Maybe it was used some days, ages ago, maybe used as cell because there are these signs here. Like four, five, six. So maybe they were used back in ages ago for telephone cells. Check this out. No exit. It is windy. There is no entrance here they say. Now I accidentally came out of the station and I wonder if they will let me in again because I really want to go to the other side of the Dnieper river but guys look at this from outside the deepest station in the world that's amazing look at this building down there do you see that? I don't know if you can see that but at the end of the street the far end the distance you see there is some kind of interesting architecture the building let's go and find out what this is some blue soviet building with a white column inside look at them it's so beautiful and next to it the orange one that's the that's the bird capital. I wonder what the bird, what the bird capital is. The bird capital. I don't know what they say it in, in Russian. The bird capital. <laughs> Here's the coffee shop. The coffee, a magic snail coffee shop. in Ukraine the Soviet coffee shop the Soviet coffee shop guys so check out this this chocolate shop I think I don't know what this is I cannot read this but I guess that's the famous chocolate shop it is Russian <laughs> Russian maybe Russian so maybe Russian chocolate here I don't know well my favorite OTP bank OTP bank good job 
Well, check out that building uh, talking about earlier. It's like in circles. I wonder what this building is. Let's check out. It looks like it's, it's a three-star hotel. Because I, I can only see the three stars there. I don't know if you can see them. It looks like it's like in circles. The Circle Hotel of Kiev. Circle Hotel. Let's let's call it that way. <laughs> the Circle Hotel of Kiev. I wonder where this, where this bridge goes. The bridge? Let's go and see. Let's go and see where the bridge is going. I think there is somewhere the monument of the motherland. The motherland of Ukraine. It is somewhere here. Huh. I see it there. The far end. I don't know if you can see it. A distance between those golden domes right at the end there is it let's go there let's go to the motherland whoa let's go to the monument of motherland I was about to kill myself <laughs> there is something modeling happening here Okay, can you see that? At the far end, in between these two domes, in the middle. Let's do that. I don't have a candle. 